wind was so big today, it just blew it right on along and it burned down mine, my neighbors. Uh, it actually made it to a, a third house. Tonight, multiple families are safe after fire tore through two homes and a duplex in South Tulsa. The strong winds really making it difficult for fire crews to battle the flames. Two News Oklahoma reporter Jeanette Quesada joining us now live from the neighborhood near 81st in South Delaware where it all happened. Jeanette. That's right, Karen. Well, two homes and a duplex all reduced to rubble. We spoke with a homeowner who lost everything tonight. She told me she's grateful that no one was hurt. I've pretty much lost everything tonight. I feel horrible. Um, I feel completely devastated. I feel like I have nothing left. It's been a really rough year for me, 2022, and this was like another major blow for me and my family. LaVonda Robinson is one of multiple families who lost everything in a fire that quickly spread to three structures near 81st and Delaware. Tulsa Fire says they responded to one house fire at 3.30 p.m. You had uh, a, a big fire going already and with the wind driving it like it is, as you can see, it quickly drove it to the other structures and once they caught on fire, the wind just fed that fire as well. Robinson says she was pulling into her street to pick up her son, who was being dropped off from school, when she noticed the plume of smoke from a distance. For I knew it, you know, I'm, I'm looking at my house go up in flames. I'm looking at the front yard catch on fire. I'm just totally flabbergasted. Neighbors recounting the tragedy as it unfolded before their eyes. The fireballs were going up in the air uh, higher than the ladder and just watched the one house and it the wind was coming from the north at the time it's kind of worried about it hitting our house and uh, then the wind switched and it just caught the other house probably within the 15 minutes I was sitting there. Robinson was not expecting to lose her home but she's grateful her family and her neighbors are safe tonight. As long as we've got each other there's no way we can't go wrong we can rebuild from there it's holiday season somebody's got to spread some cheer somewhere <laughs> you know. <laughs> And Tulsa Fire says they are still investigating the cause of the fire. Live in Tulsa, Janika Sada, Tunis, Oklahoma.